How Ukraine's paper planes are destroying Russia's military? Cardboard drones? Sounds like a joke, right? But these simple creations have become a nightmare for Russian forces, capable of taking down jets and changing the way wars are fought. How can something so simple, like cardboard, become so deadly? Let's go back to when Putin's military was seen as unstoppable. Tanks and jets, all lined up for an easy victory in Ukraine. But what they weren't ready for? Drones, big drones, small drones, and even ones made of cardboard. In 2024, Ukraine pulled off something incredible. They used these cardboard drones to take down Russian fighter jets and even destroy missile launchers. These drones are made by an Australian company, and they're called PPDS. But Ukrainians, they nicknamed them the Origami of Death. And for good reason. These drones come in pizza-sized boxes and get shipped to Ukraine by the hundreds. Once they arrive, they're assembled with rubber bands and catapulted into the sky. Sounds like a kid's toy, right? But don't let that fool you. These things are stealthy. Radar can barely pick them up, and Russian forces, they're scrambling to deal with them. Now get this. These drones are so simple that if they get damaged, you can fix them with hot glue and tape. They're cheap to make, but they pack a punch. In one attack, they destroyed $100 million worth of Russian military gear. So why are these drones so powerful? It's all about being stealthy. They're hard to see on radar, and when they fly in, they can drop explosives with crazy precision, all while being almost invisible. They even work in the rain. But here's where it gets wild. Russia started to stack tires on their jets to protect them from these drones. Yeah, tires. You know you're in trouble when your multi-million dollar military gear is getting protected by old tires because of cardboard drones. 